if Josh Allen was truly the guy they wanted, phenomenal pick because this guy is is the he's the real McCoy. He's exactly what um, you thought he was going to grow into, and he's proving it right now with the way he handles himself in press conferences, with the way he handles he handles himself on the field, with the way he handles himself in media, like just overall just a good cat. This clip right here made me more of a fan of this guy. And I'm a big fan of Jim Rome. Jim Rome is my guy. Uh, I've been listening to Jim Rome for a long time. And a lot of, uh, a lot of, I learn a lot from the Jim Romes of the world, the DPs of the world, the Stephen A's, but Jim Rome is, that's the, that's the OG for me. And, uh, but check this clip out. Listen, I don't know that there's a better match between a player and a fan base. Like being the quarterback in Buffalo is not an easy thing. Jim Kelly and I have talked about this so many times over the years. you got to be a special guy with a special toughness to play in a town like that and represent those fans. What would it mean to you to bring the Mafia, the Lombardi? I think it, it would mean everything in terms of why I played this game. Um, to, to be the best at something, obviously, it takes a whole lot of preparation, a lot of skill, a lot of guys coming together to accomplish one single goal. But given you know Bills Mafia's history and the history of the Buffalo Bills, the the things that that city's had to endure, the 17-year drought, we know about the stuff before that that I won't even mention. Um, but to give them that Super Bowl, I mean, I, I have vivid dreams of the parade and what it would be like, and um, that's it's so something I want to happen so badly that. I won't stop until we do it. So uh, we're working on it. Let me tell you something, man. Vivid dreams of a parade in Buffalo, and I won't stop until we get it. When when those lines came out, I won't stop until we get it. You, you feel genuinely, genuinely that he wants to win one for Buffalo. He wants to win one in Buffalo to be the quarterback that gets us over the hump to hoist that Lombardi trophy. And I'm going to tell you, I've, I've joked about this before. And I mean, really, it's not really a joke, but I've talked about this before. I cannot wait until we are able to be in a position to say the Buffalo Bills are the Super Bowl champs. My black ass is on the first flight. I don't know if there's, I mean, if I have to fly into Rochester, if I have to fly wherever I have to fly into, I'm there. And I'm going to be right next to y'all, and we're going to be celebrating this damn Lombardi trophy. But, boy, when it happens in this lifetime, when we have the quarterback, it is going to be something that is going to be something special. And I can't wait until we can lift that Lombardi trophy.